everybody, it's Twyla's mom, and today is Friday, February 3rd. You know what that means. We go grocery shopping after work. So, first stop was at Aldi's, and I always tell you the prices of everything that I get at Aldi's so that if you guys would like to try Aldi's or you're not quite sure about the prices, that way you'll kind of get an ideal about it. So the first thing on the receipt is a 33.9 ounce can of coffee and this is $5.29. It's just a classic roast and you have to excuse the glare. It's very sunny here but cold out. Yeah, it's in the lower 30s but very sunny. So the next thing is two cans of the cut green beans. And these are only 49 cents at Aldi's. And then the next is two cans of the Very Young Small Peas. Now these are 99 cents, but I'm kind of picky about peas. I like them to be a little bit on the sweet side. And these definitely are because they are the Very Young ones. Then we have two cans of the whole kernel sweet corn. These are 49 cents. And then we have two cans of the sliced carrots. These used to be 69 cents and they dropped the price down to 49, which I'm really glad because carrots usually are a little bit more than other vegetables. I don't really know why, but they are. <laughs> then on the receipt we have, let's see, four cans of tuna. This is the chunk light tuna in water. And let's see if we can get that light. Oh my, I dropped them all, didn't I? <laughs> there we go. And these are 65 cents a can. Now, usually, I had to pick it up off the floor. Usually, if we go, when we go to Sam's Club, I'll pick up a, I think it's an eight pack of tuna. But we're all out and we haven't gotten to Sam's Club yet. No. Then next on the list, I picked up four cans four cans of the mushrooms, pieces and stems, and these are 59 cents a can. Okay, we got those. Uh, let's see, oh, I picked up a can of mushroom soup. We're gonna have crock pot pork chops, and I put this on top of the pork chops while they're cooking in the crock pot, so it kinda makes a gravy, and then we'll have mashed potatoes to go with it, so it's pretty good. Uh, let's see, then we have some sloppy joe mix. We are going to have sloppy joes and french fries this week. And the, this can is only 79 cents. Um, and it's, I like it as much as um, the manwich kind. It's just as good. We all eat it and yeah. <laughs> Uh, let's see, spaghetti. Now we talked about this a couple of weeks ago. I picked up a box. This big box, 32 ounces, two pounds, these are only $1.45. Now yes, you can get spaghetti at Dollar Tree for a dollar, but you only get one pound. So for only 45 cents more, you get a whole two pounds. So this is much more economical than the ones at the Dollar Tree. Unless, of course, you've got a coupon, because sometimes they'll have the um, Barilla, and you can use a coupon then. All right, let's see. What else did I get? Oh, Twyla really, really liked the um, sausage and egg biscuits I got her a couple of weeks ago. Um, and I was going to pick her up more, because she really liked them. But I happen to see these blueberry pancake and sausages. Kind of like a corn dog, except for it's got the pancake with the sausage in the middle. And it's the flavor blueberry. And you get 10 of these. And they are, let's see, $4.99. A little pricey, but 
it's the size of a corn dog. She'll eat one, maybe two, you know. So there we go. Got those. Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah. They have these, and I have been wanting to get one of these for a little while, but I just never have done it. And this is a bag saver where you put your, it's a container that will hold your plastic bags from the grocery stores and Walmarts and stuff. And mine are just thrown in a cabinet, but they're, it's really messy. <laughs> <laughs> and we will reuse our grocery sacks for the bathroom trash cans um, because those little trash bags are not big enough for um, the trash cans. They, they aren't. I mean, yeah, we all know this. So I reuse my shopping bags for those, for the trash cans. And it was, how much was that? $3.99. It's a good, good deal for that, I thought. And it's decent sized, so. And then let's see, what's the next thing? Broccoli. I got a bag of broccoli. Now these are steams. You can steam this in your microwave, but I usually just put it on the stove um, because I don't like my broccoli to have that crisp taste. I kind of want it kind of mushy. <laughs> I know. It's weird. But anyway, um, these are only $1.19. So that's not a bad deal. That's not a bad deal at all. And then we have some provolone cheese. Um, just got some deli sliced provolone cheese. And this is an eight ounce package, 12 slices, and I believe it's $1.99. Yeah, $1.99. So we have that. Then I wanted to try these. These are $1.79. But I wanted to try these, and they are the breakfast bowls in the sausage. And they are seven ounces and you get potatoes, eggs, sausage, and cheese in this one. And then this one is the meat lovers. And you get potatoes, eggs, sausage, cheese, and bacon. And they're really good, good sized. I, I think I'm going to like those. Um, then Twyla asked for granola bars, but I thought I picked her up two... I guess I did not pick her up two boxes. Hmm. But I think I got charged for two boxes. I thought I did pick her up two. Oh, well, I guess I'm wrong. But I got charged for two boxes. Anyway, she wanted some granola bars, so I got her a 10-pack of the variety. You get chocolate chip, s'mores, oatmeal raisin, and peanut butter. Peanut butter chocolate chip. She won't eat the oatmeal raisin, but I will. She doesn't care for raisins. Um, then let's see. I know why. I know why. Because she rung up my popcorn as the granola bars. It's the same price. The popcorn's $1.49 for a six-pack the movie theater popcorn and Twyla really likes this so I picked her up a box of this and these are $1.49 she must have just rung them up as the granola bars who knows <laughs> as long as it's the same price I don't care <laughs> then last was it last weekend no the weekend before I used this as my chili seasoning and all they had was the hot. I always buy the uh, mild because I put Rotel tomatoes in my chili. I don't want it so hot that we, you know, can't taste it. But they did finally get the, um, just the regular flavored seasoning. And these are 49 cents a package. So that's a pretty good deal for that. They're usually, like the McCormick's and stuff are like a dollar 
sometimes a little over a dollar. So for 49 cents, that's a good deal. Okay, let's see. Then I bought a package of the white cheddar popcorn. Now I will eat a little bit of this, but this is mainly for Twyla. So, and it was a dollar forty-nine. See, all the popcorn is a dollar forty-nine. <laughs> Let me get a sip of coffee. Then I got a dozen large eggs. Now our eggs are finally going down in price. Um, I know some of you have been hauling them for like super great deal like 30 40 cents a dozen but mine went down to 67 cents and for for a while we were doing a little over a dollar for a dozen eggs but now they're down to 67 cents so i won't complain about that at all now for the last two things all these on occasion will get specialty items and stuff and um like, for instance, they have this. This time of the year is a big organizing time of the year. And they're jumping on the bandwagon. It's a little warm in here. <laughs> they're jumping on the bandwagon and um, doing their organizing. And this was part of their organizing things. But they also had some toys. And I saw these. And I was thinking next year for Christmas automatically. These were only $4.99. And it is a quick draw set. It has a 32 page book, 10 colored pencils, 10 gray pencils, and 20 funky erasers. And it comes with its own pencil sharpener. So look at this. You have got this right here, and I got a boy set. This will probably be for my oldest grandson. Isn't that cool? I love that. That is so neat. And then I got the little girl set. I thought these were really neat and a great price. A great price, too. So these will be put away for Christmas next year. And these are going to be for one, two, three, the fourth granddaughter, the youngest granddaughter. And I think she will really like these. And another thing I really liked about these too is they have in the little girl not the little boy, but in the little girl, they have like holidays too. Like there's a shamrock for St. Patrick's Day and lips for Valentine's Day. And let's see, here's a cat for Halloween. And I think that is supposed to be like an elf or something for Christmas. Like here's one for Christmas too. So I thought these were really cute and a really great, great deal in my opinion so anyway i am going to get off of here that was my aldi's haul for this week um i hope you guys are having a great day and i hope your weekend goes by really well and um i have a dollar general a dollar tree and a walmart coming up so i will talk to you guys later don't forget to subscribe give a thumbs up and leave me a comment. I love to hear from each and every one of you. Bye.